everyone, Persia here, and if you didn't already know, I'm completely obsessed with Animal Crossing New Horizons. However, there's so much more to be obsessed about than just the game itself. The community has been killing it with their custom designs, recreations, and complete works of art when it comes to their islands. Every week, I'll feature some amazing community creations, islands, codes, and all. We're kicking things off with something simple, but crucial to giving that extra bit of flair to your island. Let's check out this week's best path designs in New Horizons. First up, we have this amazing black brick road design by at Meow you, Die. you have the standard red brick design in your Island Designer app, but no other color options to choose from. I've seen some pink, white, and even rainbow brick designs so far, but there's just something so sleek and beautiful about this design that immediately stood out and made me wish I had more design slots available. I'm sure you've run into areas on your island where you wish the path tool would just make some diagonal lines, or you don't want to terraform everything to match a path. Well, with at Love Slime 9's Ivy Brick Path, not only do you get a very pretty Ivy Brick design, but you'll also be able to reach those very weird corners without compromising your seamless path. The next few designs are the perfect fix for any path that you deem a little too rough around the edges. If you've laid down a standard path, then you may have noticed that the edges of those paths leave something to be desired. That's where curbstones have come to save us. At Toria Pink Lotus has made these curbstones that match gracefully with the stone path. For those of you like me who have an odd preference for bricks, then at UDC has you covered there. And finally, go from terracotta to terra gotta have those curbstones thanks to at Melissa Senpai. I've seen a few different variations so far, but when it comes to classic roads, I really like the clean and thoughtful layout of at Thai Force's street designs. They come with crosswalks and even edges that drift perfectly into the rest of your island if need be. Street paths and new horizons have been used to make some gorgeous cityscapes and street markets already, and I can't wait to see what else can be done. Do you have one you'd like to share? Please do so below. All right, time to head back to the woods because our next path is a pair of beautiful wood stumps that actually come in two colors, brown and white. Besides the fact that they're very aesthetically pleasing, there are only two patterns for each color which will add variety but won't eat up all those precious design slots. Shoutouts to at Kaya underscore Animal Crossing for the amazing art and the thoughtful functionality. Our last entry of the week is not exactly a path, but a path plaque. Creator at Big Chaslapa gives you an adorable alternative to those signposts. With six variations in total, you can keep your town organized, labeled, and looking sleek with these plaques. Next time, we'll be taking a look at some of the best islands we've seen so far. You can download any of these paths yourself with the codes listed below, but don't forget to share with us how you've enhanced your island with them if you do. If you like what you saw and want to learn more about custom designs, you should check out our custom design guides that we have up on our channel right now. Thanks for watching and hit me up if you've got some good turnip prices.